I believe I might have my first PCB manufacturing fail that wasn't my fault. Um, I have been working with this board for about an hour and what I finally come to find out was is I had um, where blue goes into the NCS 2553 right here blue was being grounded out and I kinda noticed it but uh, didn't really think nothing of it until it failed and then I had to take a closer look and I'll uh, put my macro lens on here and show you okay here is the fail right there you can see on the right above each pad there's an extra gold line there that should be covered in solder mask it even happened over here right there even on these caps that one's got it yep even over to the far left of the board everything's got it looks like yeah so the problem was is the solder was bridging this pad to this ground plane it was only happening there I got lucky everywhere else but that's what it looks like okay I've zoomed in and, and uh, changed my light and it really shows up now we should not be able to see that gold line very obvious and why do I say it's not my fault well because I ordered 20 of them this is part of a medium run order through OSH Park and what it is you have to order multiples of 10 so obviously I got 10 or I got two of these on 10 boards 10 panels or something to that effect but so far I've only found two of these the one that I was working on and this one that show that line and out of all the 20 other than the two that had the line there is one other one that had just a tiny problem I'll put my lens back on and show it to you There's the other one that I found. I really, I didn't really see the exposed solder mask on this one. You can kind of see just a hair exposed, but right there, there was a quite a big chunk that was visible, and the pad is a little distorted. It's not nice and straight. but it's not nearly as bad as the other ones. There's another one that I didn't see that until I put it under the camera. Just another hairline. It might have been on the same board as the distorted pad one. Okay, so I went through the rest and I found two more with just a hair of unmasked ground plane showing through interesting I did find one more you can kinda of see this one's a different board but the pads are oriented different on the yellow main one and they're still at the top see I wouldn't even seen it if I was looking at it upside down Hmm. So yeah, another reason I was thinking or hoping it's not my fault is because I also ordered in the same order 20 of the RGB to component encoder boards, which same almost everything except there's one extra chip and some circuitry on this board compared to this board. You know, it's it's a 
uh, the same library parts and all that stuff so I don't know. I'll talk to the uh, manufacturer see what's up.